Good thing about species killing asteroids is that they're large and visible. What about city killing ones? Them suckers oh. slip through. Yeah, they'll slip through. Okay. Researchers at Sao Paulo State University have made a chilling discovery of a hidden population of asteroids that can pose a serious threat to Earth. Astronomer Valera Caruba from the university says these asteroids are so close and so hard to see that current telescopes can't even detect them. Instead, they orbit in resonance with Venus, hidden in the sun's glare, making them practically invisible. Venus is between Earth and the sun. Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, Neptune, all of those at some part of their orbit are sitting opposite the sun from where we are in our orbit. That's the darkest part of the sky. Using computer models and simulations, scientists have estimated how dangerous they might be. Unlike the stable asteroid groups near Jupiter, these Venus co-orbitals are unpredictable. Every 12,000 years, their orbits shift dramatically, sometimes coming alarmingly close to Earth. Karuba warns that some of these asteroids could be around 300 meters wide, large enough to create craters up to 4.5 kilometers across the Earth, and unleash energy equal to hundreds of megatons. If another asteroid comes by and jiggles one loose, we're not that far from Venus. Venus, of all planets, is the closest planet to us in the solar system. So, if it's got asteroids up front and asteroids in tow, and they're hiding in plain sight in the glare of the sun, we're at risk of one of those asteroids getting dislodged from its orbit and having us in its sights. An impact in a large populated area would cause large-scale devastation. Currently, about 20 Venus orbiting asteroids are known. Most have elongated orbits or high eccentricities that make them visible. But Karuba's study shows the real danger lies with the ones we can't see, those with eccentricities below 0.38. Even the world's most advanced telescopes may not help. Tests using Chile's Vera Rubin Observatory found these asteroids could stay invisible for months or years, appearing only briefly under very specific conditions. A future solution may come from space. NASA's Near-Earth Object Surveyor, launching no earlier than September 2027, will become the first telescope to hunt for hazardous asteroids and comets from space. Until then, scientists warned that this planetary blind spot means we could be missing other hidden threats lurking close to home. I'm not worried only because most of Earth's surface is water. Most of Earth's surface that's land is not city. Cities are such a vanishingly small fraction the total area of the Earth. Statistically, I'm sitting just fine.